What's up, everybody? Welcome back to RacingDudes.com, and welcome back to another one of my best bets videos as I kind of go through and recap what I've been doing on the best bets, strategies, things like that, and just overall how they're doing. So I'll pull up the best bets page on the screen now. You guys can check this out. Uh, I'll take my banner away here with a little magic. There we go. All right, so uh, a little bit of an update uh, on the best bets. You see right here, um, if you remember last week, I, I think I was at like 3,800 total profit a uh, year to date. Up to 4,400 now. Um, feel pretty good about that number. I've had a, had a really good streak. Uh, you know what? I'll, I'll kind of recap uh, <clears throat> what happened last week, and then and then we'll go into kind of my strategy and overall thoughts. Uh, not even just best bet handicapping, just me personally as a handicapper, kind of my where I'm at uh, in my head at least. So uh, as you see, doing doing very well uh, here. If you scroll down to this uh, leaderboard, you can you can you know search it all time or or break it down last week, last month, year to date. So let's look at last week. Um, you know, obviously it's my video, so I'm going to pull it up because I was the the top uh, earner last week. Uh, went 13 and seven, a $420 profit there. Uh, for me, yeah, got the on fire uh, tag there. Anytime you hit three in a row or more, you'll get that on fire tag. As soon as you lose one, it goes away. Um, I got four plays today on a Monday, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, but uh, as of right now, feeling feeling pretty good about it. Um, so yeah, really good week for me. And you see, uh, our our week starts off on Sunday. I did go three and zero yesterday. I'll click on this. Uh, yeah, three three nice caches here at Churchill, at uh, a two at Churchill, and then a one at Santa Anita. Um, so, uh, all good, uh, news there, like I said, hit, have hit five in a row. So feel pretty good about everything. Um, you know, that's been going on with me. So uh, a couple of things, I'll go to the back end here and here's my, you know, these will be gone by the time you listen to this, but there's the four bets I've got for today at parks and uh, horseshoe Indianapolis. Uh, hopefully by the time you're listening to this, I have four more wins. We'll see what happens. Sometimes Mondays and Tuesdays can be a little sketchy at these tracks, but we'll see uh, a couple things though, that I did add. Uh, and this came out of the recommendation of a, a really good customer of ours uh, emailed me. I believe it was, I don't know if it was Monday or Tuesday uh, and uh, of last week and said, you know, I like what you're doing, uh, but you need to add in like, what odds do you think, you know, we should bet this horse at because sometimes they are getting a little short. And also, you know, if the odds fall below, what are some other recommended plays that you might, you know, uh, take and or, or make and tell us to make? So that's kind of the thing I added here. So if you get if you buy it, you get the reasoning here. Um, you, well, first of all, you get, hey, bet it like for uh, lost luggage in the second today at parks. It says bet if six to five or better. Uh, and so that's kind of the, the low odds that I would kind of take on the horse. It doesn't mean that's your line. You could, if you think something different, go ahead and play it. And then I'll highlight, you know, uh, it, it, if you want to not play a win, if it's too short for you, like maybe this number for you might be nine to five. Okay. I don't want to do that. So here's the other bets kind of give you an exacta recommendation and a trifecta rest recommendation. Just want to give uh, anybody that buys, just want to give them the options of, okay, you know, maybe I don't want to bet a win here. Maybe I want to play an exacto or a try. Well, you should get that, right? I mean, if you're buying my my best plays of the day, you should get all the information uh, that I've got available. So that's that's kind of the thought process behind that. So kind of just trying to give a little bit more options, give guys and gals, uh, you know, uh, more information on on what's going on. So that's what, one thing I've really added uh, here is the reasonings uh, for for you know. Or not, not so much the reasoning, but just here, here is acceptable odds. Here's what you could play if those odds become unacceptable for you to play a win. So, like I said, it was a really good uh, weekend. It is interesting. I also talked to the customer and about uh, going away from sports and, and focusing just on horse racing. And it, it really, it really wasn't a time thing for me. Like I said last week, it I, I had the time to do it. It's just I think mentally you could get too much going on at once. And at least for me, <laughs> somebody might be able to manage that a little bit better than I can, but I think it was just simple, simply just had too many uh, things I was trying to do. And I, since going back just to racing and, and not looking at sports, I, I really haven't looked back. It's, it's been three really good weeks on the best bets since changing to that. I know the rockets and there'll be a rocket video coming up here a little bit later have been ex like exceptionally better the last couple of weeks. Uh, and I, again, I, I really, it wasn't a timing thing, which was weird. I, I had another friend kind of tell me, I think, you know, just focus on the racing. I said, well, I, I it's not timing. It was, I, it's just, it's headspace. Right. And so 
just kind of focusing on the on the racing, really not doing much different, uh, you know, as far as the process, just maybe seeing it a little bit clearer here lately. So things are going well. These are really taking off. I, I think another factor just kind of, you know, what happened over the summer at Saratoga kind of had me a little bit down, uh, just kind of decided it's time to put that to rest. It's just move on. You know, it, what happened at Saratoga has nothing to do with handicapping the races today. And then that's just the bottom line of it. Let's move on. So, yeah, like you say, it's just been a, it's been good. Um, you know, could all fall all apart today playing parks and horseshoe in Annapolis, but we've been pretty good the last couple of weeks there. So, uh, yeah, not, not, uh, not overly worried about it. Just, just kidding around here. So anyway, that's kind of what's going on with the best bets. I just wanted to kind of jump in. I always like doing this, uh, to just kind of, you know, look, if you're going to buy something from a handicapper, you kind of need to know, and at least in my opinion, where, where their head's at, what are they thinking? What are they, you know, what's their ideas? And so that's kind of why I, I got back to doing this to kind of, tell you you know here's what's going on here's why i'm doing what i'm doing and and hopefully that helps you kind of just understand what's going on so uh yeah like i said i to be quite honest for about a month there i really did not enjoy doing this product and then after i've just kind of revamped what i did kind of you know rethought what i want this to be I'm, I'm extremely happy with it so check it out if you need some best bets if you need some uh uh you know if you're a player that don't want to play every race, say, hey, I want to play three or four races. This is what you want. And uh, hopefully, like I said, hopefully we can keep it going. All right, guys. Thanks, everybody, for watching the video. Really appreciate you this week. We'll see you right back here next week. We'll recap it, and uh, we'll see how we did. So thanks, everybody, for watching, and we'll see you next week. RacingDudes.com is your home for the best free picks for every race, every track. It's Breeders' Cup season, and we've got wall-to-wall -wall coverage of the World Championships. Subscribe to YouTube.com slash RacingDudes right now. Click the notification bell. You never want to miss a single video. Want to make money betting horses? Bet with the Racing Dudes.